Kanazawa. I just got off an eight hour bus ride again. My bottom just fell over. I'm very tired. But um, in about five hours time, I'll be watching Zwig and Kanazawa. But first, let's have a little bit of a look around. It's a very beautiful city.
my camera is on a very wobbly tripod, but we should be okay. I'm now in Toyama in my hotel. The, the room is quite yellow. My shirt is quite yellow. My face is quite red because of yesterday's uh, sunburn incident when I went to watch Nippon TV Beletsa against Nittaidai. Um, yeah, Nippon TV won 11 nil. so go back to yesterday's video, the, the link should be somewhere, and you can see what happened when I went to watch that game. Anyway, uh, today I went to watch Swegen Kanazawa against Avispa Fukuoka. Uh, Stadium-wise, it's uh, Ishikawa Athletics Stadium, so it is a facility basically for athletics. There's a running track all the way around the pitch, so you're quite far from the action. It does detract from the atmosphere, but it is quite common in Japan to have that sort of setup. But the, the fans more than made up for the, the distance from the pitch. They were fantastic, very loud, singing all the time, waving the flags. They even had a drum kit set up behind the goal. Uh, so yeah, that was fantastic. Um, but yeah, that's the end for today's video. Uh, tomorrow I'll be going to Nagano for a J3 game between uh, AC Nagano Parcero and Sagamihara. I think it's Sagamihara. Yeah, it is Sagamihara. I think. We'll find out tomorrow. So if you if you can tune in tomorrow for tomorrow's video, we'll find out. And I'll also explain why I'm in Toyama and why I'm going to Nagano tomorrow because those of you who are familiar with Japanese geography will probably realise that it's not the most convenient or easiest journey to make. So I'll explain that in the video tomorrow. Anyway, thank you for watching and I'll see you again tomorrow morning. Thank you.